This is an instructional video for the LineView web demo, focusing on the line overview screen and the time entry system. It is best to have already watched the summary and navigation video before watching this one. When you first navigate to the line from the site overview, a layout is shown to visually represent the line. This is partly live and partly historical data. The live machine status is represented by the colour coding around each machine box. Green means ready or running. Light blue means lack or waiting. Dark blue means bill back or full in front. And red means stopped or in fault. There is also an indicator at the bottom left hand corner of each machine box. And a quick scan of all these dots can tell you which machines have been poorly performing in the last two hour period. The historical data is based on the time indicator on the top right hand side of the screen. This time frame can be changed using the time entry system. The from and to tab allows you to select any date and time to any date and time. The shift tab allows you to select a date using a pre-configured shift pattern, selecting the shift and you can calculate to retrieve the data. And the hour select tab allows you to select up to 24 hours to this time now. This can be done on a slider or using the radio buttons for quick access. For the purpose of this I'm going to select the last four hours. The summary box on the top left hand side provides the core data in that four hour period we've just selected including OEE, overall equipment effectiveness, the line efficiency, availability, performance and quality measures, the units produced, the total loss and any planned downtime within that time. There is also data for each machine including the machine efficiency, the machine speed, average speed over that time period and the number of times that machine is stopped for internal reasons. Our next port of call would be to go to the loss analysis screen to understand where the losses are against the 87% OEE.